I'm making it seem like a mere stage, but in fact it's almost everything, except for the fact that when it opens up and, and finds its true relationship with the divine, and it begins to be infused more with the divine qualities, and, and you actually have the experience, one of the most beautiful experiences for a human being. Okay, so we're at the fourth stage, presence. Much of the spiritual journey is at this fourth stage, the stage of developing presence, uh, bring, making it more natural in our lives being aware of each breath, just being aware, noticing your ego. I mean, you don't lose it, but you're in a different quality of eye. You see, each of these stages, there's a different quality of eye. It's getting refined. First, at the bottom, it was like ice. It was dense and knocked up against other people. Then it got a little more fluid, it got watery, and then it got uh, nice, pure water at the third stage. Now it's beginning to turn into vapor you know, at the level of presence. But here at this level, the next stage, and there's, this is a big journey in here, in level four. <clears throat> this is just a map. You, know. um, you have moments, or maybe you have arrive at intimacy, which some would call union or oneness with God. We prefer to call it intimacy. Uh, we never say, this, or rarely, does a Sufi ever say, I am God? Though even Arabi, who is one of the greatest of Sufis, I'll pass on what he said, because it's so beautiful, uh, what he said about the non-dual state. Here it is. He said, my journey was entirely within myself. 